everyone, welcome to my rather messy kitchen for today's coffee chat video. I am drinking out of the same beautiful Jack's Gallington mug as last time and as I'm sure you can see in today's video I'm going to be pumpkin carving which I've not done in a few years so this may be disastrous and I'm also going to be talking about a few different films that I'm very much looking forward to. So I have my carrier bag for all the goop that we're going to be pulling out and I will start by drawing on the face which will show you my very very awful drawing skills. Doesn't he look amazing? I think I will call him P.T. P.T. Pumpkin. Jeez, oh that's hard! <laughs> I can't even get into P.T. He won't open! Anyway, so while I'm trying to get into P.T., the first film I want to ramble on a little bit about is Maleficent 2. I didn't actually know we were getting this film until recently, despite the fact that it was announced back in April. Being a huge being a huge Jolie fan and of course a huge fan of Maleficent, I can't wait. I'm kind of glad that I didn't find out about it until recently because it means I kind of skipped six months of waiting for this film. So I'm kind of six months ahead of the game which is really beneficial. Look at all the brains! Yeah. Just, this is a lot of fun. I mean I should probably use using a scoop or something but I don't care. So now I have fully scooped out Petey's brains, it's time to hack into his face. I need a grown-up to help me. Oh, ow! Doesn't matter that I'm 24. Remember kids, don't play with sharp objects and don't give Amy sharp objects either. Yeah, so the other film that I wanted to talk about is Ocean's 8. If you follow me on Twitter or Instagram, you may well have seen that I've been going a little bit mental about it. We have our first pictures of Bonham Carter, Blanchett and Bullock filming and a couple of small film clips as well. And because Bonham Carter and Blanchett and Bullock are three of my favourite actresses, I am just bouncing. I just, I can't wait, I cannot. It's just the cast for this, then Anne Hathaway's in it as well, I don't think there have been any pictures of her yet. But the three Bs have had some really wonderful pictures and I just... This film is just everything. All you need is to have Angelina Jolie and Emma Thompson in it as well and I will never sleep again. It's not... <clears throat> and Girl on the Train is incredible. I've already uploaded my video review of that. But if you haven't seen it, please, please, please watch The Girl on the Train because it is perfect. Emily Blunt is like a double for Eve Miles. It's crazy how much she looks like looks like Eve Miles in this film. I kept having to remind myself that I actually wasn't watching Eve Miles and that I was actually watching Emily Blunt. I just got pumpkin juice spatter in my mouth. <laughs> it's appalling. Okay, he's kind of in the middle of eating his own mouth because I can't get it out. Remember kids, don't play with matches. Very dangerous. Okay, you can't see me. Oh, he's so cute. I'm gonna put his head back on. Oh, pity pumpkin. I love him. Uh, thank you for watching this coffee chat. I had a lot of fun carving my pity pumpkin. I wish we could have pumpkins all year round. Thank you for watching this. I'm going to go and make sure my pumpkin doesn't blow up and I'll speak to you all soon. Bye!